Hi guys, how you doing? How's it going? How's everyone doing? How are you? If you ask me, I'm great. I finished an idea that I think is pretty decent. Why will anyone care, bro? Seriously. So yeah, as I love this stamping style, Base House, I try to recreate one of my favorite tracks, Pressure by Seth Hills. And actually, this is not a remake, but I use that track as a main reference. You will probably notice that. And yeah, continue with this stamping style series. This is the track that we are going to make. So yeah, at the beginning we have a simple wrist bass playing with F and some glide and jumping notes. I combine this with some atmospheres and quite a lot more atmospheres and effects. Then I found this vocal Let's get this party started. that it was faster, so I stretched it to try to fit it with the tempo and we have this let's get this party started get this party started get this part get this part get this party started and then we added quite a bit of effects i love the zero effects and i added some distortion hyperdimension chorus and reverb and then we have all of these simple effects some ott for compression little the boy some reverb and some key of course let's get this party started get this party started then we have some stairs And a vocal, of course. Then I was on the bass back and I found this sound. It's a simple growl, but I found that if you turn this up here, you have a cool bass. So I made this basic glide wrist bass. And I took the last part of this pattern to fit it on the build up. So on the drop, I wanted to create a groovy kind of pattern on the drums. Then some effects, reverses and atmosphere to add that air candy. Then again, I opened the Banghead's presets and I found this growl and this one too. So combine. For the processing of the growls, I added distortion, OTT, some EQ, and then removing the low frequencies because we are going to fill this with the bass. I made them more stereo, but actually then I make it more mono with this knob and some sidechain. For the main bass line layer, I opened the bass back again with the sick bass preset and I created this bass line. By the way, most of the sounds of this track are from Bajas, the bass house pack that you probably know. The link is in the description, so you can check it out. So now we have the drums, the bass line, and the air candy effects and atmosphere sounds. And I want you to hear how catchy is this. So then we have the lead. In this case, I found this bass freeze RS on the band house pack. And without any processing, this is the melody that we have. Actually, this is so boring. So on this layer channel, I added a lot of distortion, OTT, some EQ and some more EQ. Ignore this by Hala and Microshift because I'm not using them. But it needs more power, so I send it to two lead bass. So for some reason this took me like 10 minutes to explain. So long story short, I added a ton, a ton of distortion, a lot of EQ. I made it a little bit wider and some effects for some automations. Yeah, that's something simple, not too many clients. Oh, what? What is he there? You! You are watching the videos and you are not subscribed. That's not cool, bro. That's not cool. So this is how the layers sound with all of this processing. And as it's not enough, I added a couple of layers.
uh, yeah, the uh, reader automation that instantly adds a lot of energy to the drop. And I also added this filter automation to some nouns. If you remember that I added serum effects and a factor on the mixer, I'm using it and this part is the last part of the lead pattern. We have many automations. So first we have some pitch automation. As you can see here, I'm making it more mono on this part and I also added an endless smile on this part of the track. Actually, this is wrong. <laughs> So yeah, then we have the effector automations. I'm automating this knob, this knob, and the dry wet. Some basic EQ cuts. And the last three automations are this river, the serum effects, this curves, and the hyper mix knob. So yeah, I think those are the main elements. For the second part, we have some hats. And I also created this freeze fill using the same sound at the beginning of the build-up. So yeah, let's see how this track sounds. Let's get this party started. Get this party started. Get this party, get this party, get this party started. Let's get, 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 get. Okay, I know that you heard this a lot, but if you like this type of videos, I would just ask for a subscription, it's completely free. Most of the stuff for this track are for the packs pack, check it out in the description. You can also comment below to participate for one free pack, one random comment would be selected next week. So yeah, just commenting you're participating. With that being said, I made another crazy basic house track here that you probably like it. My name is DXGuy, thank you for watching the video till the end, and I'll see you there. Bye!